Well, this is out of character. Excuse me, Terry, not yours. That's my seat, please, thank you. It's day one of our little mini cut diet thing. How's the diet? It's going great. Good morning. I got me, obviously, a super sweet quiche and a cup of black coffee with nothing in it. You have so much more than me. I also weigh so much more. Mm. And I'm cooler. Mm. What are these called paper clips? So it is officially hoodie weather here in Ohio. It's amazing outside. And we are doing a little mini cut diet for our band program. So everyone who orders a Bomar resistance band will actually get an entire band program for exercises, like dozens and dozens and dozens of exercises that you can do with primarily the bands, which is amazing. So we're doing a little mini diet cut for that. I'm not quite sure how many days you're gonna do it for. It just kind of depends on when we actually decide to film the program. So the first meal today we had, we had to finish that quiche because it was just like glaring at us in the, in the fridge, like eat me, eat me. So pretty much whatever you guys see me eat, just assume Josh is eat, gonna eat about double. Um, so now I'm doing a shake. And for our cut, we're, we're gonna do lower carb, but we're never going to go below our BMR ever. That's never something that we'll do. So um, yeah, you guys kind of see what we eat during this little mini cut. No, that's the bag. Is it pretty? Good girl. You are so smart. What you doing? Typing up a caption from our ab workout from last night. I mean, it doesn't just like appear. You have to like put time and thought and yeah. effort into captions. Isn't that nice when people actually read them then? Yeah, it takes a while. It does. This is actually a pretty good one too. It's about abs. So we had a few conference calls like run super late last night. So I'm sending some emails right now, then we have to run some errands. But we have very exciting stuff coming out for you guys, product wise. It's gonna be awesome. We I can tell you that we are working on samples of a pre-workout, which is gonna be really great. Um and then a few other products from our meat stick company. I don't even know if you guys really even know that we have a meat stick company. It's called Rugged Meats and it's incredible. So right now we have snack sticks that we make with them. Um, it's We have three different flavors for boar sticks and we also have beef sticks as well and they're amazing. So a few new products coming with them. The printer's quite hot. A few new products coming with them and then we have some other exciting lines that we're starting very quickly on the fitness side of things. Like I said, we are doing our band program for all of our band purchases. Um, is that it? I think that was it. So our intention was to clean the house last night and we kind of started and then we had two conference calls that took like an hour and a half each. So that kind of got put on hold. Um, and yeah, now we got to go to the post office. We're selling a bunch of our um, fitness and camo clothes. So that's why we keep running the post office like every single day because we have a ton of people buying stuff. Then we have to go to the bank again. And I think that's it. And if anyone's wondering, that's Josh's shrine of accomplishments back there. <laughs> it's like a proud, humble wife bragging moment. He's got some up here too. I guess it's right. Yep. I read a quote once that if you want your bank account to increase, your library has to increase, so keep that in mind. What do you think about that, Jer Jer? She follows me everywhere. You're like the world's worst secretary.
Okay. Get comfy. Excuse me. Are you trying to vlog now too, Jujer? Rugged meat snack stick. You're so rugged. It only has one carb in this whole thing, packed with protein. And it tastes amazing. It literally tastes identical to breakfast sausage. And it's made from? Wild boar, yep. which is really cool. Because not beef, which is fine if you get beef, but it's straight from the wild. These boars are caught in Florida. Yeah. You guys are obviously seeing everything that we're eating today. And you might notice that we don't physically consume a ton of greens and fruits and vegetables and those kind of things. And that's because we supplement with a lot of things. We're going to explain to you why. So. This is just a little quick snid bit of the supplements that we take. This is our multi. It also has a fish oil. There you go. You can see that. And all of its benefits. So Josh is going to explain why we take veggies in supplement form instead of actually eating them like from the grocery store first of all how's my hair terrible it's great <laughs> I'm like totally bumming it right now so please judge me it's okay um so what you guys have to realize and i'm going to give you a long version because i think it's going to make a lot of sense for you bananas aren't grown in ohio so when you order or when you buy a banana at a grocery store it probably came from somewhere where bananas grow which is like columbia or any of those places. So you wonder how in the world did bananas or any other fruit or vegetable get to your grocery store? And so that those are questions that you need to ask yourself because the point is, is when you pick them up at the grocery store, they're not ripe. And you're like, wait a second, didn't it just come from across the world and it's at this grocery store and it's still not ripe? In order for these fruits and vegetables and everything to survive the shipping processes, they have to pick them prematurely before they're ripened while they're still hardened so then they survive the shipping practices and they're not bruised and beat up when they're on the, the shelf of um, a grocery store. So when you cut a vegetable or a fruit from its lifeline, which is its vine, branch, whatever it's on, immediately all nutrients that are flowing into that vegetable or fruit is cut off. So whatever's in there is in there. And so whenever you pick a fruit prematurely or a vegetable prematurely, it's not getting all the vitamins and minerals and everything that it would normally have in it. And so what you have to take, take in consideration is the fruit in today's world is not like it used to be, and neither is the vegetables. So all you farmers out there that are watching this, you all know I'm telling the truth. So unless you're buying everything locally, um, or growing it yourself. Or growing it yourself. You can rest assured that you're not getting as much vitamins that you really should. So Sarah and I... Plus all the stuff they spray on. I mean, that's a totally different conversation. Well, yeah, but you know, just... But, I mean, like Sarah just mentioned. I mean, all the stuff that they spray on it to grow it as fast as possible to keep up with the demand in the world is ridiculous. So what Sarah and I do is what a lot of um, bodybuilders and everything else do, and we would highly recommend you guys doing is take a really powerful vitamin. This vitamin isn't cheap, and the cheap ones don't work. I hate to break it to you. So you get what you pay for in the vitamin world. You know, this is from Pharmanex. We do sell this, and we get commission on it. So the link will be right here. <laughs> so make sure you buy from us. You know, we, we wanna get, we, we wanna get that, that credit. The reason that this vitamin works so well is obviously the, the growing practices of where they extract the vegetables and everything else, they can let these vegetables grow to their maximum potential and, and then harvest the vegetables, extract all the nutrients, whatever. Um, but what's really neat about Pharmanex um, vitamins is this nanotechnology they put in there. Let me, let me focus it. Ordinary nutrient, nanonutrient. So water-soluble vitamins, fat-soluble vitamins, 
all the same stuff. Um, your body can only absorb so much at, at any given time. And then your, your body then will urinate out what it doesn't use. So what's really, that's really unfortunate because you would think we would have evolved to be able to hold, you know, extra vitamins and everything else for whenever our body needs it. But unfortunately we don't. So that's why you need to constantly make sure you're eating vitamins and minerals every single day, phytonutrients, whatever you can get your hands on. You want to make sure that you're doing that every single day. So the reason that this works so well is because this helps break down the fat soluble vitamins that your body Necess or normal fat soluble vitamins clump up like this in your intestines. Clumpies. And your body's only going to absorb a fraction of what's actually in there. You know, so what, with the nanotechnology, it allows your body to absorb way more than normal. So the, the how, benefits. But how do you know if it works or not? That's a good question. Um, New Skin, the owners of Pharmanex, has a product called a biophotonic scanner. Here's a picture of it. This biophotonic scanner um, tests your levels of antioxidants in your body. Depending on your lifestyle and everything else, really has huge factors on your levels of antioxidants. So let's say you smoke, you're gonna kill your antioxidant score. If you do tobacco, you drink alcohol, you drink too much, too much um, things high in acid, I mean, you're gonna kill your antioxidant score. We've tried a lot of different supplements in the world. I mean, that's expensive just- Expensive ones. Expensive ones. And our score didn't change. The biophotonic bio scanner, we tested it one week, three weeks, four weeks, didn't change. We started taking Life Pack Nano. Like two years ago? Yeah, about two years ago. And along with, um, and we weren't taking inexpensive stuff. I mean, we were taking the best that we thought was on the market and we still scored high. I mean, the score goes up to 50,000. So it's zero to 50,000 and 50,000 is really rare to find somebody that can go all the way to 50,000. I mean, you've got to be a nutrition genius to get to that level kind of thing and be extremely healthy. So we scanned 44,000, which we were pretty excited I about. I was 47,000. Sarah scanned 47,000. So we thought what we were taking was pretty good. And then the guy that was um, Jeff, who was helping us out with getting us started with New Skin and Pharmanex, he scanned, and he's in great shape, don't get me wrong, but I figured we would have scanned a little bit better because of how much money we were spending on supplements. He scanned 55,000, which was above the scale. I was like, dang it. So we stopped taking everything else. We started taking Pharmanex, Life Pack Nano, along with some other Pharmanex products, and within, it was eight weeks, mm -hmm. Um, our score went from 44,000 to 50, it was 55,000 and like 58,000, which was amazing. And then within, it was three months, our score went all the way up to 77,000. Yep. Yeah. You can't it's, make this stuff up. Can't make it up. So <laughs> it's amazing to think about how high, I mean, it was just insane. Forgot to mention that it's, it's not just a multi, it's, there's a fish oil as well. Yeah, well that's honestly, it may look expensive if it's just a vitamin, but there's a vitamin, minerals, fish oils, there's like four or five different supplements. Well, and the fish oil is like the best in the world. A lot of fish oils are very cheaply made, and yeah. obviously that's because the cheaper your product, the more profit you can make from it. So with the Life Pack um, or the Pharmanex fish oil, and you can just buy the fish oil by itself, that's totally fine as well. But with the fish oil that comes in this pack, they, the, the oils that they use are actually derived from very tiny fish. It's krill and anchovies. So, so if it's, it's a big fish, those big fish are eating smaller fish, which means they're eating the waste of smaller fish, which means the oil will then contain higher levels of mercury. Higher levels of mercury it's not as effective. So, so you go you go to the bottom of the food chain, and when you go to the bottom of the food chain, you're getting the most purest source of fish oil. And and again, it's more expensive to go to the bottom of the food chain, and then they don't, they go to parts of Antarctica in order to get this bottom of the food chain fish because I think it's like um, anchovies and krill or whatever. Yeah, whatever anchovies and krill. Yeah. So. I mean, that's the most amazing part about it is they go to parts of Antarctica in order to harvest this amazing fish because it's that good. Like if you've ever taken a fish oil and you burp it up and it tastes like rancid. It's because it is. That's because it is. You could take this fish oil Which and you would never ever taste anything. And didn't you poke it poke it open one time and yeah, drink it? And drink it. Yeah. And again, it's, it's a very, very clean sushi taste. This 
This is 60 servings, so if you want to try it out at a less expensive cost, you can make it last two whole months if you just do one pack a day. Go upstairs and show you guys this book that I read a few years ago. It's called The Supplement Period, Pyramid, and it validates everything that we just said. So we're not the experts. We just read experts and then regurgitate what they say. So, oh, Jerry, God love you. Mm, supplement, here it is. So we are getting ready to go out into the woods. We're gonna pack some snacks. These, these are like the best tasting almonds ever. Okay, friends, so when you are really trying to diet and cut down and lean out, you really need to measure everything. So, get you a scale. They're like $12 on Amazon. Read the serving sizes. So I'm gonna do one ounce, yes. One ounce is 160 calories of almonds, so. And you'll kind of be sick when you see what it is, actually. There we go, people. One ounce of almonds is that many. So our plan was to go hunting tonight, and unfortunately, sometimes things don't work out in your favor, but... Still gonna have our snacks that we packed. Um, we have some running around to do, so still going to have our delicious snack sticks that we showed you guys earlier. And, all right, so we came to Beep Beep Bop and I got a salad with chicken, cucumbers, corn, and potatoes, and then I got the salad dressing on the side. I'll do the old dippy, dippy trick. What'd you get? Something not anywhere near related to what I got. which is very, very similar in property, like brown rice. Then I got spicy chicken and steak, and then a ton of eggs. And then some vegetables. And I see some sauce there. Yeah, I got some sauce on the side. It came out really fast. I didn't actually want that what much, ever. so. <sighs> His and hers. But they have nutrition over here, so you know exactly what you're getting. As you guys can see, I'm done. And you can see how much sauce I actually used. Me too. So again, the trick, dab the fork first, then put it in. So our meals were a little different. What do you mean? Yours was way more in calories. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let me explain something to you guys. You may look at that and say, how in the world can Josh stay lean when he just ate nine Hundred calories in Nine. one meal. Nine hundred eleven. Don't forget that eleven. So let me let me explain something to you about losing weight. You think think of your calories that you take in on a daily basis like a bank account, and you can only spend so much every day, or you go into debt, and by that mean and that means you get fat and you gain fat. So you can spend it. Let's just say however you want. So I have probably another 2,000 calories at least left in my bankroll. So guess what? I can have a 1,000 calorie meal and still be in a calorie deficit and still lose weight. What do you think about that? How do I buy more calories? Here, you know what? You gain more muscle. That's how you buy more calories. I'm 135 pounds straight muscle brick house. Nope. You need to be 180 pounds straight muscle, and you're going to be solid. You'll so, anyways, I know you're chatty, Kathy, because you just had 911 calories and oh, you're I high feel, on carbs. Oh, I feel good. Um, but if you guys don't know how many calories you need to be in taking in order to lose weight, or if you're trying to maintain, or if you're trying to gain. We've mentioned this before, we are fitness nutrition certified. We have a customized interactive meal plan that will do just that for you. And not only does it kick out the numbers that you burn on a daily basis, which is your BMR, but it also takes into account your activity, which is your total daily energy expenditure. And somewhere in there is the sweet spot. And that's what our meal plan kicks out for you guys. So if you don't wanna do all that work by yourself, please, just hire us. It's super inexpensive. We give you videos on how to meal prep. We give you videos on how to track your macros. We give you videos on how to eat when you're traveling and the whole shebang. And so that I'm, way you don't have to waste years of your life uh, trial and error on yourself. 
and I and I can honestly say that it is the most comprehensive meal plan system out there. I've never seen anyone else do what we do, and how perfect and how exact it is. I mean, it is gonna, it is literally as good as it gets. Okay, we are making protein pancakes. So there are some tricks to making protein pancakes turn out really well. The first is you want to let this warm up. I have mine on medium high heat. So let this warm up. Let your batter sit for at least five minutes before you use it. You want to pour very slowly and then you're going to flip when you start to see bubbles. Yep. Oh. Okay. All our YouTube fans out there, it, this is ridiculous. I agree with you. 